Hey everybody, Tammy here. I want to do a brief video for those of you that have received the new Aver panels. Um, this is in regards to the app switch button that's within the home button over there. So I'm going to show you a couple of great tips. Please, please watch because um, there's one that you really need to do as far as getting rid of the applications as you open throughout the day so they're not bogging down the system and dragging your device. All right, so as I said, I'm at the home screen, and if I go to either one of the anchor buttons here and go to the app switch, um, this is going to show all the different apps that I have opened um, to that point, and it's a really good way at this point, if you have multiple classes and you're teaching the same things throughout the day, to easily access the things that you use frequently for your classes. So I'm, here's my classroom. And then I go back to app, app switch, and then I can go back to my drive. Um, so it's a, an easy way to get back and forth to all the applications that you're using. So that's one um, good thing about app switch. Another really good thing about app switch is split screen. So the way you would do that is you would hold down what you want to split, one of the options you want to split, and you can go to the left or the right. And then you choose um, another option and you just click on that and it will populate the other side. So you have a split screen option here. You can um, slide a little bit to where you, the size of both either side can be bigger or larger and it can go both ways and it will expand that one. When you are done with the split screen and they do work, um, independent of each other, which is really nice. But when you're done, you just slide it all the way to the side until you're back to a single pane. Um, and then you can go back to app switch and choose two more or, or however you want to do that. So what I do want to finish with is at the end of the day, when you are done, we don't want to keep those applications going. It's very, very much like on your, your, personal device on your phone or your iPads. Um, we don't want those um, different applications pulling data from the network. It just bogs it down and it could affect the performance of your device. So what we're going to do is in the app switch, when we see this very, very like what you see on your phone, we're just going to slide those applications over until they're gone. And it's, it's basically, it's killing apps, um, which is a way to say that. So if I go back to app switch, it says no recent items. It doesn't have anything that's open at the time. Just an easy way to close all your applications so they're not bogging down and slowing down the system. So if you have any questions, let me know, and I hope this helps.